CNN's Elizabeth Kame Rhoda got very personal on Friday when she talked about her own history of depression in the wake of the suicide of beloved chef and author Anthony Bourdain. In a segment talking about the importance of reaching out for help from others if you're experiencing suicidal thoughts, Kame Rhoda said that she has gone through hard times where she never believed she would ever be happy again. Depression is so common, she said. When you're in it, you think that it will never lift. I've had dark days. I've had bouts of, in my 20s and early 30s, I've had a dark cloud that I thought wasn't going to lift. Kame Rhoda said that while feeling sad at times is perfectly healthy, depression makes you wrongly believe that that sadness will never go away. Sometimes it can be situational a breakup, a loss of a job but those things do change, she said. And time changes, and medication helps, and therapy helps. There are things out there for people who think they are in a downward spiral. Later in the segment, CNN posted the suicide lifeline number for people to call when they have suicidal thoughts, 1-800-273-8255. Anthony Bourdain, a famous chef and author who was the host of CNN's Parts Unknown, was found dead in a hotel room on Friday. According to CNN, the 61-year-old Bourdain took his own life while he was in a hotel room in France, where he was filming a new episode of Parts Unknown. It is with extraordinary sadness we can confirm the death of our friend and colleague, Anthony Bourdain, CNN said in a statement about his death. His love of great adventure, new friends, fine food and drink and the remarkable stories of the world made him a unique storyteller. His talents never cease to amaze us and we will miss him very much. Our thoughts and prayers are with his daughter and family at this incredibly difficult time. Bourdain was found unresponsive in his hotel room by French chef Eric Ripert, whom CNN describes as a close friend of his.